welcome to the Exotic Trash Episode Podcast. Podcast. I'm your host, Joey Simcoe, <laughs> and Jimmy forgot that we have a name. Hello, and welcome to the Exotic Trash Podcast with your host, Joey Simcoe, and me, back from the dead, Jim and, Skidmore. And here today we have our guests, Little E and Tim Dumb. Oh, yep. wow. I wow. can't believe you did it, Jimmy. <clears throat> All right. I liked my name. I like Little E. Little E? Makes me feel... It's kind of ironic. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? You're a large Why? guy. You're fat. <laughs> I'm sorry. I... <clears throat> that, anyway. that was very insulting. Well, that's... And uh, oh, it kind of, of, of insults. insults. Let's talk about our topic today. Caitlin, Caitlin Bennett. Bennett. Now, otherwise known as the, the Kent most State hated Gun Girl. Person on no, Not to be no. confused with Caitlin Jenner. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So I feel like just we the same open person. this up first with how she got her claim to fame, which was bringing well, an assault rifle she, to her to graduation, graduation and posting a which picture. Which we've all been there. <laughs> okay. So As us graduated. Let's just get some opinions on uh, what we thought of that stunt real quick, and uh, we'll talk about that a little, all right? Who, who wants to I, I, I think I will go first here. Uh, to start this episode, I just want to make it abundantly clear that I am pro-Second Amendment. But... I hate the concept of taking your guns open carry. My whole thing with the Second Amendment is I think everybody should have a gun that wants one, but it sh- you should never see it because that defeats the purpose of carrying it. The whole point of having this gun is if something goes down, boom, I'm ready and I'm safe. If you're open carrying it, then whatever's happening, you're immediately the first target because they know you have a gun. So I think that open carrying your weapon anywhere other than the shooting range, because don't conceal yeah. carry into a shooting range, you'll get killed. But uh, I think open carrying anywhere other than the shooting range is a god-awful idea, and I do not support it. Also, I mean, I get that she's trying to protest something right now, but what purpose would one have to bring an assault rifle to graduation. Yeah. I know. Well, you never yeah, know. Well, even if somebody were, like, going to start something or there was yeah. going to be a fight, I doubt it would be to the level where you would need an assault rifle. Yeah, I, yeah so, I, so I, I think... Yeah, okay. I, well, I, I'm also pro-Second <laughs> Amendment, but is it really necessary to bring... What was it? Was it an it's AR-15? AR-15, yeah. To your graduation, like first of all, it, and it was a shitty one at that. <laughs> I just want to point out it was not okay. kitted was it well. It was I, I believe it was. It was and not kitted well though. I feel like it could in- induce fear on some people. Oh, definitely. And, like, why do you need it? It's not yeah. proving a point. I don't think it proved any point to anybody that you need to bring a gun to a graduation. It's it doesn't make sense. I to think me. the best comparison I can I can possibly bring here. She right? had an AR-10. Which is a shitty, a shitty Which is five less. <laughs> no. which is a shitty. Five less <laughs> Not quite, but I understand where you're coming from. <laughs> no, I think the best, like, some of the best comparisons I can make here is, like, you know, you could just wear a, a necklace made of condoms to graduation, and nobody could tell you you couldn't. Right. But well, what are you doing by doing that? Because her whole I'm point is... I'm protesting my right to wear a condom. condom. Because the whole point of that was, oh, I can do this, so yeah. I'm going to do it. But there's a lot of things that you can do just to do. Yeah. You can wear a sign on your back that says, oh, you know, I'm a dipshit. Please kick me. And it's not illegal. And, yeah, you could do it. Yeah. But why? So. <laughs> What's the point? I actually, when the yeah, whole thing finish. first came out, I actually Ew. supported her. Because I, myself, am actually an advocate for the Second Amendment, despite being, like, a bleeding heart liberal. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh. Yeah, I actually supported her because I was like, good for her, you know, this is great, but, like, the more I get to know her personality and what kind of person she is, I think she's an awful person. But, like, back to she's also her whole beginning, I I did support her standing for her right to own a firearm, but I feel like she did it in an over-excessive manner. Like, she could have just brought, like, a little handgun and no one, and she would have gotten the same message across. But like, I don't think I don't think she put any message across. Honestly, she arranged a march of just people carrying their guns through the campus. Yeah, that doesn't State. seem well, scary at all. No, it's like, fun. oh well, you know, Kent State shootings yeah. never happen. Well, so. don't forget oh, yeah. that the government did that. The government shot up yeah, Kent State, not the people. 
<laughs> if anything, I'm pro people at Kent State having guns on <laughs> yeah. them, just in case the but government still... ever act up again. <laughs> That's <laughs> hey, watch it there. <laughs> a march of just people carrying. Heavy yeah, that weapons. would not have been a good idea. Whose phone's going? It's on? just Cherry. <laughs> oh, turn that! I swear to God, I swear to God, definitely cracked. Well, that's. I'm because, gonna march a gun that's to your because, house. Uh, the reason why we delayed <clears throat> one episode of podcast for a week. You know, there's a better chair, chair over there. The oh, you know, there's another chair. Oh, over there. <laughs> but yeah. um, no, I think my thing here is I don't actually hate that march protest, and I'll tell you why because march protests in general I hate them. But they've kind of become the new political what you got to do. If you want to get your point across, you kind of have to do a march. They do them for all causes. Now you have the women's march, the pro-abortion march, yeah, the anti-abortion march. Yeah, but this was also for, for open carry, which well, you said you disagreed with. I, I disagree with doing it. I don't disagree with what? why they're doing well, it. Well, I think if you disagree with them having uh, a march, you'd kind of be disagreeing with the right. First Amendment. Yeah, I don't disagree with the march. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, My right. main issue with open carry is I don't like the idea of open carry, but I still have to support the movement for it because the way American politics works is yeah. you have to ask for a mile to get an inch. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, the people that go to anti-abortion rallies, most of them are more or less not 100% because obviously the statistics always brought up, obviously, of, yeah. you know, like, oh, what about incest and yada yada? Most of the people there that are there for that just want, you know, no abortion on cases where that's not an issue. But they have to demand all of it in hopes a little is conceded yes. because bureaucracy doesn't work. All right, so I got some uh, discussion topics here that were given to us uh, through YOLO on Snapchat. Never heard of her. Uh, that's not how that works. <laughs> I hate you. I hate so, you. So uh, the first thing that – the first response I got was do an actual top ten communist. I did. <laughs> I, did. I did that was the video <laughs> that, 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 that was the video and like what are you going to do about it like everyone on the list is a confirmed communist including Bernard Sanders including Jason Voorhees <laughs> he's a confirmed communist, confirmed communist. he's an eco-communist <laughs> <laughs> next question the, uh, the next discussion topic is see you next Tuesday which in case if you don't know what that stands for it Oops. means they're calling, yeah, they're calling her a cunt. <laughs> they're just calling her a cunt. <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> and uh, ne- next, next question. <laughs> Would you pipe Caitlyn? Uh, so, <laughs> so, okay, so there's this one picture I saw shit, her in a bikini, might. and then I remembered, oh wait, I saw the picture of her with shit on her legs. Okay, I'm but, good. okay, is that her? Shit. It is her. Do we know? I don't I, think we know it's her, but I think it's, it's, I think it's pretty well known. She'd that never admit it. She Do would it never state. admit it. So she, it's not like we could ask. Would, would you admit it? Which picture? That don't. means no. <laughs> no. That means no. No, I, I I do think she did poop her pants. <laughs> okay, but there's nothing wrong with she pooping didn't have pants. pants. No, like, but it, it was so bad. It was we, bad. It was, a, it was a lot of poop. It was. <laughs> it was a lot of poop. <laughs> I still don't. Know. Okay, I, I don't remember the last at time least I two pounds of poop. I, 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 I want to say I don't remember the last time I pooped my pants. It's probably a couple. A long time ago. Yeah, well, that, a I remember the last time I pooped my pants. <laughs> I do too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you did. I don't think I remember. Guys, I, I think I just shit myself. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, I so remember. honestly, why should we listen to your opinion either? You also pooped your pants <laughs> during a game of uh, Friday the Thirteenth. At least she was drunk. You were, <laughs> you were just playing a video game. Well, you see, <laughs> hey, it was my, a scary my video. Was my bull, my bowels were oh, uh, oh. by my excessive coughing. Gotcha. That makes sense. Is that what did it? Yeah, that's what Next that's question. What uh, next person said... <laughs> when we didn't answer the question. Yes, we did. We did. Uh, we wouldn't. No. Pre- pre-poop, yes. <laughs> Post-poop, no. <laughs> pre-poop, yes. In the middle of... I'd consider it. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna get down and dirty. Stop. No. <laughs> she needs to stop harassing people, and STFU, which stands for, shut the fuck up. 
because she's not right about anything. Wow, that's not a question. That's, well, that was okay, a statement. Okay, first things first. Well, I okay, I think you topic. can't say she's not no, right yeah, about because anything. So, because most of the only thing she most talks of politics about. is opinionated. Yes. Anyways. So here's the thing. No, objectively, both, my opinions are the only correct ones. So here's the thing. <laughs> both <laughs> both <laughs> sides of politics have these extremes. Yes, and that, that's what's wrong. And like, when you think of the other side, you usually think of these extremes, yeah. but you shouldn't think of the extremes because there's people mixed everywhere in those two sides. And yeah, but there's also, mainly like two Jimmy sides. Jimmy said, if you want to get anything done, it's got to yeah, be you gotta ask for That's the problem. Yeah. We're about like two years out from having to burn ourselves in the street to get a point across <laughs> like that one. <laughs> Cutting our arms. What's that guy that did that? The monk, but, uh, this, the monk that burned himself yeah. alive. This uh, discussion topic brings up a good point that she like constantly harasses. That's people. true. She does. And, like, I agree. All of her questions are all the same, and it's like, how would you feel about gender neutral bathrooms? And then like some to reveal herself to be Caitlyn. Yeah, Bennett. reveal herself to be Caitlyn Bennett, and she's just wearing like extra eyeshadow. Yeah. <laughs> the glasses. <laughs> she's wearing kryptonite glasses. It really, I think the problem is, she's a gun icon, <clears throat> so it's to speak. Clear. Icon. Yeah. So she's a. Definitely a right wing icon. She works for Infowars. I was gonna yes. say she's a correspondent. Yeah. But in like yeah. modern politics, we have it sectionalized by issue. So I don't think she should argue issues other than what her main point is. Jimmy, you want to read this next one? <laughs> Which one? This one. <laughs> this one? Yeah. Not her. Give us someone else. I don't. I don't know what the fuck you're asking. <laughs> Do you want a different person? Yeah, we, okay, we Michelle can't. Obama. <laughs> No, no, we're not talking about Donald J. Trump. <laughs> we're not talking about my Donald one of Trump. my least favorite presidents of the United States. Oh damn! Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Huh. All right. So well, one of FDR is still my number one least favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because he's not a president; he was a dictator. He got us out of the depression as oh, a dictator. Oh, as a dictator, uh, best a dictator, dictator we've ever had. Yeah. Worst president. <laughs> and then uh, someone said she went to Ohio. You're yeah, dang right. she lives in the fucking state. Yes. She also yes. Well, I, I think, believe what they I meant think what they're referring to is the well, Ohio she, University yeah, Ohio thing. University okay, well, and everybody well, at Ohio University rioted. Which well, I here's don't blame them. But no, also, no, I don't think no sh- I'm now. I'm murder you. <laughs> now what she's trying to do is right now she's trying to organize another gun march <laughs> through the OU. That's going to be awful. That's going to be get she violent. She wants to organize a march of guns like at Kent State through the college that rioted about She that. realizes that's not going to end well, right? Well, here's like, the thing. That's so fucking Well, tough. I don't think... Politics is motivated by violence, though. So yes. you, they, she wants something to happen. I don't think you should get violent, though. Like, obviously, she's offensive, and I don't... Yeah, but who's going to listen can to You protest woman? something and keep peace. <laughs> yes, you can definitely <laughs> protest. You can keep wow. peace. <laughs> yeah, but peaceful We're never going to get lame. famous now. Because pe- I told no. you... Peaceful protests don't work. That's day. not always Peaceful true. protests do not work in the United States. They, honestly, I disagree. I think they could work. Okay, how the about the Virginia march? Get change is the, the, riot. the Virginia House still uh, went ahead with that bill after everybody marched in favor of guns. <laughs> so, yeah, and that should, was peaceful. Yeah, but there's no... I think... Okay, so... So what Jimmy's saying is we all need to overthrow the yes. government. I'm not and that's saying the second that. amendment. What Jimmy the is saying is we need to overthrow the United States. That's government. not. I am. I am somewhat <clears throat> pro government. He said somewhat, somewhat. but <laughs> somewhat. But the problem is the government is corrupt, and I'm not a Republican. But I'm also I don't I can't support the Democrats because they want more government, and more government's a bad thing because then there's more to be corrupt. So, so I'm not anti-government. I just wish not, things were you different. Want less government involved in life. I liked uh, what's his name, George Washington. <laughs> You'd like to George Washington? I li- no, you I, say that as if that's a verb. No, no, I said I like. <laughs> He's like back in my no, day. No, no, I George said, Washington. I said was Washington was the newest dance craze. I like the 1930s. I, okay, let me rephrase that. I liked all presidents up to Woodrow Wilson. Oh, so. You didn't like Woodrow. No, because it was uh, he overstepped his power by sp- picking a side. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> you have the next think. discussion topic is who the fuck is she? I we answered honestly, that one. So she is she is a far right uh, gun. I don't know she if I say she's a correspondent with InfoWars. So Republicans hate her. 
Liberals hate her. Everybody hates her. Except people who follow her. Yeah. And they're their own political party. And they're just parties. simps. And I feel like... A lot of simps. Too, too many people give her that's attention, nice. and I feel like that's what feeds into God, it. Where's and we're just... Honestly, we're just helping feed into it right now. But I feel like we need to talk about this and how this is like a big... I found issue. some really funny comments about Caitlyn Jenner the oh. other day. Uh, well, t- while you're finding that, we'll just go on to the next discussion question. And it's, did you really shit your pants? We Which already, one? We already, we already t- yeah, like, yeah, they're, they're asking you? if I shit my pants. The answer is yes, yes. The answer is yes, I have shit my pants. Recently. Re- and I'll tell With, I'll tell the story. It was quick. Okay. I think we got We've got time. So, the boys and I, we was playing Friday the 13th right. on uh, the PlayStation 4. Good Netflix. game. It's a really Very good, good game. game. Play it's it a again. Great, we should. It's a great game to play what with. What are you, friends. Yoda? <laughs> <laughs> it's a great game. No, he goes, play, play it again, again, we should. Play it again, we should. Ketamine. Ketamine is so good. <laughs> but, uh, so, we were just playing, and I was going through, like, this really uh, weird cold. You were Jason, right? I was Jason at no, the time. No, you weren't going through a cold. No, I, w- I did have a cold at the time, and that's why I was coughing so damn much. Oh, okay. But I was coughing a lot throughout the game. Don't you, you guys are assholes. Do you remember? But, yeah, I was coughing, like, a lot. And uh, I apparently found the brown note. <laughs> oh. I, I coughed so hard at one point where I had the Hershey squirt, and it just spread. And let me tell you... I wasn't even at my own fucking house. <laughs> I was Where dog was sitting for my dad's assistant wrestling coach. Don't tell him. He's gonna no, see this. Yeah, I know. I don't. I don't care. It's a <laughs> hey funny man, story. I shit your house. I sh- no. He doesn't live there anymore. Who cares? No, I, it was very funny because I believe you were chasing me. I was and, chasing him. And, 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 and he stopped. <laughs> he stopped, and I, I said, go. I'm like, what's happening? Hold on. Let me get close to my yeah. like, Guys, I just shit my pants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then we and then we escaped. Don't fucking touch it. I was and, like, what? and then everyone just fucking died. I thought he was kidding. And, yeah. No, and like it was, and usually when I play as Jace, Jason, there's already like complete radio silence because I don't talk as is. <laughs> That's why it was funny. <laughs> it was funny as fuck. Guys, I just shit my pants. Because <laughs> I just stopped, and then everyone was like, everyone saw Jason wasn't moving, and then, and then we're like, just okay. Kept, kept on who the fuck? Hey, who is this? Oh, Who's here? Yeah, this is podcast. This is podcast. Oh, yeah. Yes. What's up? Would you like to join in podcast? We've got this empty, is uh, empty Kean, seats. Kean Thompson, Key and Peel here, and uh, Mr. <laughs> Daniel Stubblefield. They're, they're here. <laughs> He's very <laughs> excited. He's very excited because you know Chris can't turn the volume up. We had, we had to come in here. We play superhero a little bit. And <laughs> very good. Mike's the yeah. mic's right there. Mike's though. here. Uh, well, I just have a blank face now. <laughs> That's fair. It's cool. Yeah. 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 Topics of the podcast. Yeah. 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 What? That uh, chick from Kent State. The yeah. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. <laughs> this is for you. <laughs> this is for Kitty. Idiot. She is an idiot. That's, that's been the consensus yeah. so far. She is an inciter of violence, and that is all I have to say. If you want to call her that. Right. <laughs> that's hey, his words. Uh, yeah, so we talk about how she shared his pants. Like, oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> we talk about that. We're trying to, to yeah. a diaper party. <laughs> 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 I think she did. That's awesome. Oh, 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 I yeah. believe so, yeah. yeah. Okay. Sorry about the interrupt. That one wasn't even a bit. That just happened. Yeah, that just happened. Like, <laughs> think, we that. I think they deleted them. Oh. Which one? What was our next question? Uh, next uh, question is, I usually respect everyone's opinion, like, and I like a healthy debate, but she goes out for the sole purpose of offending people. That's true. I'm just going to say that's yes true. to that. And that is honestly, that is borderline harassment. She is harassing well, the people thing is, with every order. The thing is, she... Offends people and then people offend her and the, it's just these, yeah. this endless line people of people don't respond peop- how yeah. they should. They people like, sh- should just ignore so her. I really, honestly, I, really I don't like the people who respond like very calmly and yes. like very quickly to her and like it's all negative too. It's like, uh, do you have an issue with uh, men peeing in the women's restroom and blah blah blah? And then dude's like, no, I don't fucking care. And then 
Uh, she'll ask another question about, so you mean that men shouldn't be wearing tampons? And dude will be like, I have one in right now. I don't really care. Excuse like, me? Yeah, <laughs> like the dudes will just. This is Joey who's typing this. <laughs> he keeps it in just in case he gets the shits again. <laughs> Unless he, he keeps that in there just in case. So this is, so this is like in an interview. Guys will say this in, in the interview. Yeah, well, you always wear one just in case. Just in case. And, like, just in totally case. degrade whatever she's asking. So, I think someone should challenge her to a duel. I'm gonna murder like, you twice. Okay. I, are, can questions. I get a fact check? Are duels illegal? Can someone check oh, that for me? Like, 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 like you I mean like facing is, duels? Yes. If someone formally challenged her to a duel. Hey, there is a spot. I think uh, in one state. In, is it Idaho? Are duels legal? Where there's a 50 uh, square mile zone oh. in Idaho where all crime is legal. Because of a flaw Guys, in the Constitution. Is this but a it purge? Hasn't been tested the yet. purge? It's not illegal. <laughs> it's not so illegal. So someone should someone challenge her yeah, to a next, duel. The next reason episode it's not of illegal, though, is because it doesn't say anything about it anywhere. Next <laughs> episode of podcast. So this is there's next only one chance. So it's should not illegal, table, but it's <laughs> not legal. No, that means that there was, one person gets one more duel before the law is makes it <laughs> That's legal. Bad. So that means one person. Let's use it on Caitlin, guys. Well, <laughs> don't fuck up. I think if you're willing to open carry a gun, you should be willing to participate in a duel. <laughs> that's, I think I don't so think that, that's, I, that's how it worked in the Wild West. <laughs> if you want to open carry your gun, I think you should, by all constitutional means, be willing to fight in a duel. That's I, also first amendment. You can't really conceal an AR-15. They that's can. True. She On did. you? Yeah. She they did make a, They make double barrel sheaths no, that go down your pant she leg. She didn't conceal yeah. it. It was open. Huh. You can conceal Yeah, she was open carry at the graduation. All right, next question. Uh, there aren't enough characters to explain my hatred for her. Yeah, uh, that's hate, not true. Hold up. <laughs> hate is a strong word. We don't hate okay, anybody. We don't hate anybody. Well, but strongly we do dislike. dislike her stupid fucking opinions. <laughs> I think um, that's a stupid remark to make. That That's obvious right. hyperbole, and we don't yeah. appreciate that kind of unprofessionalism. Yeah, we need uh, statistical facts and evidence So, uh, here. shut and the know, fuck and up. You know, trash. And, you know, I don't think it's her opinions that matter. I think it's the way that she pushes yeah, out her opinions. The way she opinions. presents herself yeah. that definitely ruins everything about her. Yes. All right. Next question. Whoever made that comment, stupid. Thoughts on her. I, I'm this is what this is why we made a few? podcast yeah, on the episode. God, you God, think people? Let's not even answer that one. Okay. Skip it. Describe in one word. All right. Well, let's go around the circle. <laughs> and, uh, Poop. Okay. Evan? Annoying. Uh, crazy. Uh, poop in parentheses part two. <laughs> <laughs> I might also say woman. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean that's just facts. That's not another thing to come bite us back <laughs> in the future. That, that's not a negative thing. Yeah, that's though. not a negative thing. She just is a woman. We've been <laughs> trash okay. talking her the whole I, time, I, and then one word women. to describe her as a woman. Someone said, "Can I abort her?" That's it's a little late for that. It's a little late. At that point, it's murder. Wait, that's the, but that's all abortion. That's, that's, that's how we can organize the Got duel. Got a Catholic in the room. <laughs> okay. okay, it's okay. It's so, okay. And the next uh, nah, question we don't need is, to ask that. We already no, answered. No, I want to hear some say. of the questions. We've already answered this yeah, question. We've already oh, have we? Most of the questions. Fuck little Miss Poo Poo Pants Bennett. Next all question, right. please. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, ask her. As if we're going to have her on the oh, fucking don't, podcast. Don't do this. <laughs> <laughs> no, say If it. my aunt had balls, would she be my uncle? We were really ready. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> we, were Shit, answered, I don't know. we answered this last podcast. We, we did. did, yeah. And you know who, I know who asked it. It was probably it was Austin. Austin. Austin asked this Austin question. Definitely of course did. it is. Well, that's all the time. <laughs> that's all the discussion questions we have about Caitlin. So, uh, Wait, is that the other one? Uh, 23, what? that's what it is. Yeah, I was like, yeah, so we still got a little bit of time to talk still. So Rick Moranis, Rick Moranis we've is been a doing great that. actor. Have you ever seen Little Shop of Horrors? We're talking about. Yeah, but we've already talked about. I it. actually think Rick Moranis is a good actor, hold on, bad hold on. person. B- before we, that's before I we disagree. Change subject, before we change subject, any concluding statements on Caitlyn? Uh, she needs to stop. <laughs> I mean, she can't thanks, Tim. I think that's basically she's gone too far already. Yes. So at least either. Calm down with what you're doing, or just go away. Cause yeah, <laughs> please. I think you can have your opinion. I have nothing against your opinion, but the way you present yourself, yeah, it's yeah. annoying, yes. insulting, and just stop, please stop. Okay. I think um, the cause she's fighting for is good. 
I like anything that's pro 2A. I do not like her. Not in like a, oh, I hate her kind of way, but just in kind of like a, she annoys me and I'm not going to actively try to find anything she does and yeah. take it as actual reading. Yeah, so, my final concluding statement is, eh. <laughs> okay, so, the whole thing that has been a huge divide in this country has been the extremities and the people focusing on the extremities. What is, what the fuck, so, what is he saying? Well, if you'd let me fucking talk. <laughs> okay, just continue. So, Caitlin is obviously far right, and then you got people that are far left. And when you're visiting college campuses where you're more likely to find people who will be on the far left and you try to trigger them and piss them off yeah. I feel like you're just trying to incite violence and try to make yourself seem as if you're the victim when you're the one that's out constantly harassing people and trying to belittle people which is what Caitlin does and what? I don't agree with what she's doing there can I make a, exactly okay, a final I was gonna, um, can I say something yeah you go ahead so you as a liberal we're n- it's not like it's only the far right because it's both sides making yes, these. Yeah, of course it's, it's both. Yeah, both sides, sides are the problem. Yeah. Because like nowadays it's you can't. Yeah. A lot of people are like, well, they're the op- they have opposite political views as me. I don't want to be their friend. It shouldn't be like that. That's it should stupid. be, it should be okay. They have different views. It's we don't need to talk about it then. Yeah. And yeah. it's also like when you're arguing, it shouldn't be well you're wrong and here's why. It should be. I think you're wrong, and here's why I think you're wrong. It shouldn't be you are wrong. Well, sometimes people are wrong. Well, yeah, I'm not gonna agree. I'm not gonna be. Like, I'm not gonna be like, oh, you're racist. No yeah, what. yeah, I that's fine. Because like, that's not fine. Yeah. Politics in general, like, like in the past couple of elections and stuff, has gotten so brutal. Like they used to be political opponent opponents and everything, opponent. <laughs> both <laughs> fighting for the same thing, but they could still interact with each other yeah. and, like, get along with one another. But a lot of poli- it's just war yeah. now. A lot of politics... It's just political like, warfare now. A lot yeah. of politics is the same problem and different ways of fixing those videos problems. Have you Parliament? No. Yes. They're just yelling at oh, each yes, other yes, the whole actually. time. That's yes. just so funny. Can I put one final statement on this whole thing? Yeah. In her defense, <clears throat> pissing people off is really fun. It, it is, is really fun. fun. It is fun. So but when you're doing it, like, as your job... I, oh, tell me that's not a dream. That is a dream, but God damn it, it's <laughs> annoying. It's annoying to hear people complain about her. It's annoying to hear her voice. It's Everything about her, I think, is absolutely annoying. But I would do it for funsies. <laughs> put it on the record that we put would... It, put it on the record that I would do what she did for funsies. Funsies. <laughs> going on a shirt. I would annoy people as a job for funsies. <laughs> well, that's uh. Well, we're not. That's it. Are, are, are we done? I yeah. think so. Okay. Okay. Uh, thanks for tuning into the Exotic Trash Podcast. I'm your host uh, Joey Simcoe. I'm your and co-host, poop. co-host Jimmy Skidmore, and Poop. Timo. Ev- <laughs> Evan. Uh, P.